At the old 911 showing, we are on the east portion, the lower portion, pulling out more samples today from all this mineralized area. First sample we pulled out right here, calcopyrite and boronite with some pyrite this was just one sample we broke out from this area here you can see the mineralization we're gonna keep going there's another sample J2 just pulled out See the ground is littered with them all over the place. So the goal is just to dig out more samples today. Add to the stockpile. See the calcopyrite chunk all right there. Let's get to digging. We have Two more pieces here. You can see the bottom is pyrite with calcopyrite, and this whole top area where there's quartz is all calcopyrite. Second piece here, very similar. The whole bottom, however, is calcopyrite and you got a bit of boronite in there and then on the top you have pyrite mixed with calcopyrite in a band hammering chunks out of this side right here here's a few that I got off right now Quartz with pyrite and calcopyrite. All the dark patches you see in there, if you look up close, that's actually a bluish color and that's just the oxidation of the calcopyrite turning a little iridescent color. Same with all this dark at the bottom here. Clearing out some of this area here, over top of where the vein is, just pulled out our first chunk from here. You can see vein material. Pyrite and calcopyrite. This is the vein down in here. Running below. There is small veins and everything running up here, but the vein has more calcopyrite down below. And it's also a little more massive. Broke that piece in half. Here's the five pieces that came out of there. There's one, number two, number three, number four, and number five. And 
it is a mix of pyrite and calcopyrite, minor boronite, quartz, silicified schist. Let's get out some more. A few more chunks we hammered out of here. Working on the base of this, the bedrock here, as well as down here. Pulling out samples from here now. This sample is the last one I pulled out. You can see the quartz with calcopyrite pyrite. These are the few I pulled out before. Similar mineralization. We're getting to a point in our diggings where almost half the material that's loose in here is sulfides, if not more. You can see this is some of the more intact pieces, but when you pull it out, it just so deteriorated, it's almost clay-like, but it's half, if not more, sulfides. Pulled off a bunch more samples in the last couple hours and we're going to start small, work our way up to the bigger ones. These are a few of the smaller ones. These samples have far more calcopyrite than they do pyrite. Always nice when you see some boronite in there. Nice big chunks here. It's all calcopyrite, some boronite. Outside here is a bit of pyrite. And we got more chunks here. Extremely heavy. Got another big one here. And final piece, biggest one, easily. 250 kilograms, 300 kilograms for the one sample, and that is this right here.
All this blue is from the oxidation of calcopyrite. We're gonna hammer a big chunk off of this and have one last look. And I've broken off a little piece here. This is the last sample we'll show. So we got about another 500 kilograms out of the stockpile. See you next time.